2019. I'm Robert M. Price, and uh, this is the poem October by H.P. Lovecraft. Mellow faced with eyes of fairy, wistful clad in tinted leaves, see the brown October tarry by the golden rose of sheaves. Oak and acorn in his garland, fruit and wine skin in his hands, mystic pilgrim from a far land down the road to farther lands. Softly treading, gently breathing, casting spells on wood and mold, vines with purple clusters wreathing, witching boughs to red and gold, bearing sickle their pleasure when the harvest toil is o'er, and the autumn's garnered treasure lies within the festive door. Bearing dreams to all who listen as he sounds his elfin horn, where the crystal vapors glisten past the farther hills at morn, where the sunset hovers playing on the teeming cottage yard, till the cryptic night comes straying in a mitre tall and starred. Dreams elusive and uncertain, fleeting as the dying year, glimpses from behind the curtain have to cherish, have to fear, memories that charm and beckon, vanished scene and vanished face, phantoms past the worlds we reckon, reaching from the wells of space, mounting as with necromancy, welcome visions hold the sight, Bygone fields assail the fancy, radiant in a golden light. Ancient lanes lead cool and bending past remembered farms and byres, where the curling smoke ascending tells of happy autumn fires. I can catch the flaming riot of the oaks and elms I know, and the breathless ruddy quiet of the sunset's spectral glow and the farmhouse chimney peeping through the scarlet maple shade, and the gorgeous fruits of reaping by the door in order laid. Greens that red and yellow dapple, tints that match the blazing sky, swelling pumpkin, rosy apple, clustered grapes of Tyrian dye, and behind the orchard, reaching where the rolling meadows bide, I can see the corn shocks bleaching and the stubbles stretching wide. Skies alive with southward winging, ravens perched on sheep and stack, groves with eager trumpets ringing as the quarry flees the pack, swains with nuts and faggots plodding homeward, to the twilit garth, soon to cluster, warm and nodding, round their cider and their hearth. Notes of village bells are soaring, peaceful in their vesper tune, as an eerie light comes pouring from the rising hunter's moon, wild above the wooded mountains, weirdly shining on the streams, yellow floods from haunted fountains, witches dancing in the beams. Half seen sights from outer distance, half heard sounds from other spheres, beat with goblin-born insistence on the spirit's eyes and ears. Thoughts half thought and yearning sober, formless as the autumn smoke, these thy gifts obscure October, these the symbols of thy yoke. Mellow-faced, with eyes of fairy, wistful clad in tinted leaves, see the brown October tarry by the golden rows of sheaves. Oak and acorn in his garland, fruit and wine skin in his hands, mystic pilgrim from a far land down the road to farther lands. Happy October.